My name is Don Kripal. I'm currently Director of iDetect Services with the Capital Center for Credibility Assessment, C3A. Also a member of the Converis Technical Advisory Board for iDetect. I have 30 years of federal service, all of it in the credibility assessment arena, primarily in the area of polygraph, but more recently other technologies as well. Both polygraph and the iDetect systems have advantages. For example, with the iDetect station, the tests are very, very quick, they are automated, they're fair, the decision algorithm is based on actuarial data, so it's completely valid. We understand what the error rates can be. The advantage of polygraph is it's also very thorough, that is, an examinee can make certain statements and the test questions are adjusted to uh, accommodate those statements. Polygraph examiners also elicit information after the examination of a failed test. And uh, that's one of the advantages of having polygraph examiners uh, conducting the testing is that dual skill set. The question in my mind is, is one better than the other? The actual answer to that is both of them used in tandem afford advantages that neither technology can offer alone. For example, pre-screening with the iDetect system can tell you which individuals are more likely to be successful in the polygraph examination, and those individuals should be given a priority in if you're trying to test an applicant, they should be given priority for the polygraph examinations because more individuals will pass the polygraph examination and, and move on for hiring. In the case of government employees where you're looking for the insider threat, poor performance on eye detect would mean that those individuals are tested sooner and therefore you can intercede sooner as a manager if it requires that the employee receive remedial training in handling the classified information or more security, uh, security troublesome cases where law enforcement investigators can come in and try to determine whether there was a serious breach of national security. Another advantage of using the technologies together is that they are independent tests. So though both of the technologies are imperfect, both of them have less than 100% accuracy because they're independent tests they'll make errors typically on different cases. And what you will find is that if they agree on the outcome, your accuracy will be much higher than the accuracy with each technology alone. For example, let's suppose that each one of them has an error rate of about 15%. If an individual took both eye detect and polygraph and was called deceptive on both tests, each of them having an error rate of 15%, the likelihood of that person really being truthful is 15% of 15%, which is roughly 3%.